What's up guys? It's Natural Woman 26 and I know it's pretty late, but um I'm gonna do my like haul of things I bought um on Black Friday. Not everything is um girl clothing actually. I did buy a couple of um of pieces of guy clothes because I do like wearing guy clothes once in a while. Actually most of the time if I can, but yeah, so uh, I'll show you that, and I bought a couple of things from Sephora, and I'll probably show you that too. So, yeah. Okay, so I'm gonna start out with the uh, guy clothing that I bought, and this first. <laughs> so, okay, all the guy clothes I bought are actually Star Wars stuff. I'm planning on. I have five Star Wars shirts, and now one pair of Star Wars sweatpants, and I'm wearing on wear on. Uh, I'm planning on wearing a Star Wars shirt every day, every weekday, next week, um, leading up to the premiere of the new Star Wars movie. And this first shirt is a little bit big for me, but um, it was the only one left and I needed it. It's Don't Be, <laughs> Don't Be Basic, and it's a shirt with clone troopers on it. Um, and obviously I needed it because I dislike basic people. So, uh, this is this was the last one. It was on the mannequin. I took it off the mannequin, and yeah, I actually wore this one already. I haven't worn my other ones yet, but yeah, love it. Okay, so these other Star Wars shirts I have, I have not worn yet, but um, I'm going to. Don't worry. This one is the Empire Strikes Back, and um, it's just, you know, Boba... Vader, you know, here's Luke down here, Chewbacca, all the, you know, important characters, and, um, needed that one because I really liked how it had all the characters on it. Um, and then this one is probably my favorite one I bought, um, it's a tie between this one and the Don't Be Basic one, uh, I love this, it's like a long sleeve crew, crew neck um, sweatshirt and it says <laughs> Mary Sith Miss and it has Darth Vader in the middle and uh, TIE Fighters up here and I am really excited to wear this. Um, I think I might leave this for the day Star Wars comes out. Actually, day before because I'm going to be wearing this next shirt on the day it comes out. So yeah, this shirt. You know, I was actually planning on getting a different shirt. But since this one was for The Force Awakens, which is the new movie, I decided to get this one because I needed, I just wanted one um, that just was for the new movie, as I said. So, got this one. Just buy one, get two free at Macy's. By the way, this is all from Macy's so far. Actually, most of my stuff is from Macy's because, did I say that already? I don't know, but I love Macy's. But Macy's had great deals, so, um, for real. Like, I... I love shopping there, probably, it's my favorite store to shop at. But anyway, these are the Star Wars pants. It's funny because my friend, I was wearing, I wore these already, and uh, my friend was like, I hope you got those 50% off because only 50% of it's printed on. But I actually really like how it's only one. Oh, here's a Death Star. Oh my gosh, I just love these pants. Um, so yeah, I love the pockets. These are guy pants. I've all everything, all the Star Wars stuff is guy stuff. And actually, it was way better deals for the guy Star Wars stuff and the girl Star Wars stuff. And more, they're more comfortable, so that's why I bought the guy stuff. But uh, yeah, love them. And that's it for the guy clothing. But um, a lot of the stuff, a lot of the like pants I buy are like sweatpants and stuff like that. So um, that's why I I like guy clothing because I like being comfortable. The next thing is this like poncho thing. I was intrigued because of the pattern. It's it's pretty comfortable um, and it looks like a blanket. It literally has like this fringe and like if you just saw this bottom you would literally think it's a blanket. Um, so it's like a blanket you can wear. I tried it on and I love it and um, it is like you know like short sleeve kind of thing but I can easily wear like long sleeve under it because you know winter is cold so yeah but this is really nice I really like this on next I got this um, cardigan thing it's pretty long and I love it so much um, it's like pretty tight on here um, on the um, on the arms and it's like stretchy and it's like pretty lightweight but 
I just, I love how it looks and I love the pattern and it's, yeah. The next thing I bought, I saw and I instantly had to buy because I love this kind of look um, to wear, as you guys probably know. Um, it's just this like jean jacket, but it's like gray and like washed out, you know, and like, I just, I love, 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 love clothes like this. Um, it's very like baggy and like really comfortable, so it like almost looks like guy clothing. Um, and it's kind of like grungy. Uh, I don't know, like I know that that term is like pretty overused, but it's just, yeah, this jacket thing, and I really like it. That's actually all I bought for tops. Um, no, I lied. What I'm wearing right now, actually, I bought. I will turn around and show you. So in the front, it's just this really loose, like, um, black shirt. And let me move this chair real quick. And in the back, it's just like this crochet, and I really like that a lot. Um, I like the crochet because I think it's pretty. And uh, it's not like one of those shirts that's like too revealing in the back. It's just like, you know, slightly different. So it's cool. And the main reason I went Black Friday shopping was for pants and stuff because um, I just realized I have makeup on my pants right now. Oh, that's wonderful, but anyway, yeah, I, I wanted bottoms and stuff because I really like sweatpants, as I said, and like a lot of stuff I own or owned um, were jeans, and they were either just not comfortable or I just wanted like other, you know, clothing options. Um, these two first ones are actually skirts because I can wear, you know, like leggings underneath them um, with like boots and like a sweater, but these are, it's just really long. And I love it on a lot. It, um, it's like it's like high waisted, so it goes like up to here. And yeah, it's just like flowy on the bottom, and I love it so much. Like it, I love how it looks, and um, it's like a very wintry pattern. Like you know, it's not like a summery kind of um, material. Like it's pretty thick. So yeah. And then I have another one that is basically the same. Um, I think it's a different company. No, they're the same company. Um, it's like pretty much the same material, just like all red. And it's basically the same kind of deal. So, yeah. Also, sorry if you can hear the fan in the background. It's really, really hot in here. And it's like blowing on this bag. It's making a weird noise. I don't know if you're going to be able to hear it or not. But I'm sorry if you can. Then I bought these pants, which I saw and had to have. They're actually a little bit small. But, um, I just, like, loved the pattern so much. I, I don't know. I don't know why. But I, I just loved them. And they're actually, they look really cool on because they're, like, pretty tight up here. But they, like, are straight-legged. So they're, like, flowy at the bottom. And I just love them so much. Next, I got these sweatpants. And I love these a lot, too. I just really, I, I like, love everything I bought. But, um, anyway, these are just gray sweatpants that just have like the elastics at the bottom and I like these a lot because on the side they have this mesh and like you can like see through it and I just thought that was really cool like it was just like instead of just regular gray sweatpants or even just like a stripe down the middle I just really liked how it was like see-through. I'm also obsessed with the brand Rewash. I love their flowy summer like shorts um, so and I love like their pants too so their long pants um so I got these and yeah they're just really comfortable basically I just you know like weird printed pants uh interesting prints you know and so just got these everything I got also was like I think like ten dollars or under um maybe maybe twelve dollars or under so they were like really 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 good deals I also got these leggings from Macy's and I just thought they were really cool because they look like pajamas and they feel like pajamas but they're leggings and they're really really comfortable and I just needed them. And then I got a pair of just regular blue jeans but they're so comfortable it's crazy. They're celebrity pink and they're like the feel me collection I think or something like that. I'm pretty sure that's what it is. But yeah, so those are cool. And then I also got um, a pair of high-waisted jeans. 
I just looked everywhere for them um, for like 10 minutes. I like went through all my dirty laundry and everything and I can't find them so I have no idea what happened to them but they're really really good like really nice too I think they're also celebrity pink but I might be wrong and basically my last clothing item were these pants and like oh my gosh these are so soft they're hot kiss which I've never heard of this brand before but they're such good quality it's crazy like they're so soft I can't even like I can't even explain how soft they are they also have the the thing at the bottom like not really like elastic but whatever this is they're just tighter at the bottom but like I just I don't even know how to explain this to you like why I was while I was wearing them because I've worn these too I like literally had people feel my leg because these like these pants are just like so soft and yeah I just I love them so much if they have if I find more colors I'm definitely gonna buy more of these and that was basically it for clothing um i did get some um stuff from victoria's secret which i love um body the body collection by victoria's secret body by victoria's secret is probably my favorite um i love it so if you're a girl new shop at victoria's secret body by victoria's secret highly recommend then i went to sephora and I only got two things there, but um, one of the things, I'll show you in the case first, but there's like blue stuff, I'll, I'll show you. Um, I, OCC Cosmetics is Obsessive Compulsive Cosmetics, and um, they are, ha they have like little lip tars, which are like, they're kind of like liquid to matte lipsticks, but like the lip tar, you have to like, it comes out of the tube and you have to like put it on with a brush and I'll just I'll take one out it comes with a primer and two colors and um, if you guys follow me on snapchat or twitter you will see that I wore this like the day I got it or maybe the day after I think it's the day of but it's blue and it's really cool because I, I don't know I had just dyed my hair and I was like blue lipstick let's try it so um, especially because it was like a, a small test tube it was like um, on sale or like one of their special like deals to get this little three with the primer and I actually don't really like the primer I think if I when I wear this again I'm probably just gonna put the lip tar on by itself um, I also have a gold one of these that I love and I never used the primer before and it stayed on like a lot better than when I did put the primer on which is interesting so yeah got that and then I also got um, a face wash from Sephora and I don't remember what the name of it is and I don't think I have the box here oh I do just kidding the box is here it is um, first aid beauty face cleanser it's just uh, just a little little size of it it's the box it came in it's in the shower right now but um yeah I I like it so far it's pretty good um, I don't know I feel like uh, it's not as exfoliating as it I would want it to be um, but yeah, it's it's pretty good. I don't know if I'll buy it again, but if you want to try it, it's alright. And yeah, that was it. That's everything I bought. Okay, hopefully this video isn't too long. I've been recording for like 20 minutes now, but hopefully I can cut out parts where I was like grabbing clothes and whatnot. Um, I hope you guys like this, even though a lot of you, I don't know, I don't know how many girls are gonna watch this, but. I hope you liked it anyway. Um, I wanted to apologize because I know there hasn't been a um, gaming video in forever. I think the last one I posted was like the Minecraft series I had been doing, which I actually really did like, but we had to end up stopping that because um, we weren't on enough and it was just not that well organized, especially with everybody going back to school. And the setup I have here is not ideal. Um, I really like recording at my house uh, with my brother's setup, actually. So that's why I haven't been streaming or uh, anything like that for a while. But um, I really want to get some Black Ops 3 stuff up, uh, Rainbow Six Siege, Battlefront stuff. Hopefully I can do that when I go home next week. And uh, yeah, so if you guys want me to do any other kinds of videos, let me know. Uh, thank you guys for watching as always and especially the people who have been here since I did Strictly Gaming and have like watched my videos even though I've started to change some of the content. I still 
very much love gaming and want to post gaming videos, it's just a lot harder for me to do that because of the setup. Um, so hopefully I can get that figured out, especially for next semester. Hopefully I'll be able to record here um, more of that. And yeah, so thank you so much and have a great day or night or whenever you're watching this.